Hey Pisces, what's up Pisces? Welcome back to my channel. It is Ashley here at Fire Intuition and I am here to be your you versus them love reading. This will be for Pisces, Sun, the Rising, also Venus. Keep in mind that this is a general reading for the sign of Pisces, but it may or may not resonate with all of you Pisces out there. So please do only take what resonates, never force it to fit. The September box is now available on my online shop, my tears have my heart.com. You guys can also check the community tab, my IG, our Facebook page for additional um, information. And if you guys would love to book a personal reading with me, fireintuition.com. All the information you guys need for um, my personal readings, the September box, the raffle, all that will be pinned in the comments below. And if I do resonate, like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll follow, hit that bell. Show your girl some love, Pisces. All right, so let's hop into your reading and let's see what's going on with you and your person. Spirit, please leave me messages for Pisces. How does Pisces currently feel when it comes to their person and their relationship? Let's see, Pisces. All right, let's see, we have the page of wands, six of wands. Oh, you are excited about something, Pisces. Somebody has your attention. Uh, okay, but we have the star in reverse. It's like somebody has your attention and then you lost interest. Are you losing interest in somebody? At the bottom, we have the eight of pentacles reverse, eight of swords, five of cups, kind of disappointed. Things started off great at first. Things are good. There was a lot of excitement. You guys are going on dates, seeing each other. You were getting a lot of attention. But now you guys are losing hope and faith in this person, this connection. You're losing interest. You don't see this working out. You don't see yourself being in a relationship with them. And for some of you guys, you just kind of feel sad and feel like, damn, like, am I ever going to meet or attract someone that I really like? Because I feel like in the beginning, you felt like this was it. Like, I finally met somebody. I'm liking them. I'm feeling them. But the Five of Cups is you just, like, kind of just, like, sad. Just, like... I feel like you guys are like in a little energy. Like, I'm just tired of this or disappointed. Because I feel like you guys were talking and spending time. Like I said, going out with somebody, enjoying them. Um, but something has changed your mind or you have lost interest in this person. Could be an Aquarius with the star members. So I'm getting you lost interest quick. So let's see what's going on with Pisces. All right, let's see. Spirit, why is the page of wands here for Pisces? We have the King of Swords reverse. Okay, so you caught them up in some lies. I feel like even from the beginning, um, you caught them up in a lie or you just felt like they were like cold or their demeanor, the something changed their personality, the conversation. We have the Ace of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles. We have to pay the cups. But I don't know, Pisces. I feel like even with that being said, I feel like you guys still like them. You like the conversation between you and this person. This person was talking about love, looking for love, a relationship, a commitment. Even children. I fight this person. But it has to be something that turns you off or has you not liking them. So that's how I feel like you guys are really liking this person. And you thought you met somebody but lost interest really quick. Because the King of Swords is in reverse. So you must feel like this person is lying about all that or lied to you about something. So we're going to see. Why is the Six of Wands here? Eight of Cups in reverse. Hmm. I feel like you're losing interest like you lost interest because maybe you feel like this person is going to go back to somebody. Because hmm. we have the Eight of Cups in reverse coming back. Or right, this could be somebody that came back to you. And was like, you know, talking to the game, like, you know, I love you. I want to be with you. I want to marry you or, you know, let's try it again. But let's see why the Eight of Cups is here in reverse. Judgment. Two of Swords reverse. Some of you guys find, found out that they went back to somebody or that they were thinking about going back to somebody. And that's what they were lying about or that's what you found out. I'm not sure how you found out. It's not telling me just yet. But let's see why the Two of Swords here. The World card. Somebody went on a trip, traveled, went on a vacation, did something, was at a distance. Or went on some type of job, vacate. I mean, like some type of um, work 
vacation or something like that and somebody found something out or you just found out that they were talking to somebody at a distance or somebody online or that's how you guys could have met is online but I'm getting at somebody like you found something out let me see something real quick what did Pisces find out about this person why did Pisces lose interest yeah you, you found out that they were still talking to somebody at a distance are they still talking to somebody that they have a family with are they telling somebody that are whatever this is you just communication eight of wands you could have seen it through text email dm something like that you found out this person could have been giving somebody money giving into another situation has a family you found something out ten of cups you found something out it has to do with a family a relationship somebody else going back to somebody going back to somebody that they have a family with and so you just lost interest that's why the star is in reverse. So you just you lost interest. So it started out good, and you thought they were the ones, but I see, but I see you lost interest real quick. Eight of Wands, the lovers are reversed, the five of wands, yeah. Something turned into some type of argument. I thought you confronted them about the situation. You confronted them about what you seen, what you found out, what you heard, whatever this communication is. Um, it looks like there was a breakup, could have been a Gemini as well. Are you guys are just deciding to like no longer talk or like I said, it started an argument. Somebody confronted somebody. Five of Wands is like confrontation, but it's also like confronting somebody. And you're just like giving up on this situation now is when I'm seeing Pisces. You're like, mm-mm, no. Like, how do you want to like be with me and you're telling me this, but, you know, talking to somebody else. Somebody can work out, out of state or out of distance as well. But it's something that you saw. You saw this. Like, the Eight of Wands can be text, DMs. Like, you saw it. You saw some type of communication. Communication, Sorry. So, let's see um, how your person is feeling, Pisces. I don't know. I'm also getting, like, somebody lives in, like, the suburbs or lives far out. And, or you do. But I can I just, I don't know. I heard somebody like, oh, you want to go out there with them and be all fake. That's what I'm hearing. So, I don't know. Like, maybe this person or this other person is just a different type of life they have a different lifestyle or maybe you do or somebody feels like like you're like pisces like not saying you are but they may feel like you're like the uppity the bougie one the higher class on like you know like you live in a nice area live in a nice place you know um it can be like really sunny where you're at nice trees it can be like a safe environment safe area something like that but it's like whoever this is there two there's two different lifestyles so, like so like for example like the ex can be someone that like not to say it like that but i'm gonna just say it somebody can live in the hood and somebody lives in like the suburbs or somebody is like a city person and then somebody is like a suburban person or somebody just lives in a state or, or a city or area that's like bad and the other person lives in like a nice area and somebody's like dang like so you're talking to them right because I, what i was getting was somebody is like surprised or shocked by what they find out about the other person that's how i'm saying that but it has to do with the living or like the way the person looks or like they're living or something like that. It has something to do with like a family, a location, a lifestyle or something like that. And somebody been buying somebody something, gifts, money, spending, splurging, you know. I'm not like getting like materialism cards, like designer and nothing like that. I'm not getting the Ten of Pentacles, but I feel like somebody's been spending money, cashing somebody out, buying somebody things, doing stuff. But I just feel like the, like you and the other person are two different people. Y'all are opposite night and day, you know, or like just different type of like the way you guys live and your upbringing. Something is different about you and this other person that they are thinking about um, going back to or it's something like that. Okay. I don't know. I don't know why I'm getting that, but. If it resonates with you, or you know what I'm talking about, then that part will resonate with you. Let's see how your person is feeling, Pisces. We have the death card in reverse. Yeah, I see being slick, doing something behind your back, something with the ex, or um, dealing with somebody. And it's like there's another situation, something that's not over. Knight of Pentacles. And I feel like they felt or knew that they were going to eventually go back to that person. Or somebody was waiting for them to return and come back. We have a death card in reverse. That has to do with an ex. Or maybe their ex is not letting go. Maybe they never let go of their ex. This can be you, Pisces. Maybe you never let go of your ex. Could be a Scorpio. 
We also have Virgo heavy and um, then we have Gemini energy. Why is the death card in reverse for your person? We have the shame card. We have the six of swords. See, somebody at a distance is holding them back or trying to come in the way of you guys being together. The shame card is like somebody like strongly in the way of, of you guys, like are holding this person back or somebody that has tied on um, somebody, like, you know, like just trying to, you know, hold them back, keep them to themselves. They're still attracted to this person. They still want to be with this person. There can be a child involved, a boy, a child under the age of six. Yeah, they could have a child with this person. I'm seeing the emperor come out. This is somebody that they were committed to or um, they have a child with if they're not committed to this person. Two of Cups. Yeah, there was, there's still some, either there's still feelings here or their ex feels as if they're still in love with them. The King of Pentacles, the Queen of Swords. See, so... They put themselves in a situation, though, Pisces. Let me see what they've been telling this person, because there's something going on. And for some of you guys, there's a lesson that they're needing to learn with this person, too. Judgments in reverse. But it's also telling me that it's going to be a lesson for them. And they're going to get, like, played because the Ten of Swords is here, not the Pentacles. They know better than to go back to this person, whoever this other person is that they're thinking about going back to. It could be a Pisces that they're going back to. So they could be dealing with a Pisces as well. Because I had a Pisces, I had the high, the high priestess that fell out in reverse. Okay, this is somebody that is horny, manipulative, secretive. They have secrets. They blackmail, play games, all that type of stuff. Okay, um, but you guys know I don't take cards off the ground. But I'm just telling you guys. So with the magician in reverse, let's see what's going on. The sun. They were going to secretly start back over with this person. And if it didn't work out, then they were going to fully like this be with you. We have the tower reverse. A part of them has not let go of this person either. Somebody was lying about a pregnancy too to get somebody back to them. See the empress in the sun. Back in August, somebody lied about a pregnancy or it could be a pregnancy. But I feel like it's a lie because somebody's getting played over here. Somebody, their ex or somebody is playing them. Why is the sun here with the empress? Ten of wands, three of swords. Yeah, so somebody can come back to them. And their plan was to get pregnant after the person came back. That was their strategy. Their plan. The five of pentacles, yeah, because they felt hurt. They felt left out in the cold. That person wasn't giving to them anymore financially or had cut them off or did something to make, like, they felt, like, just lonely, left out. King of pentacles, seven of swords, reverse, see? So they had to lie and do something to get this person to come back around. Why is the knight of pentacles here? The higher font. You could, um, you guys could know each other or know of this person. Y'all don't like each other. Y'all don't get along. Or they're telling you bad things about this person. Yeah, see, look, Ten of Pentacles. So their plan was to go back to somebody, though, Pisces. I'm going to tell you that now. I'm going to keep it 100. What is this about? Knight of Swords in reverse, the Seven of Pentacles. That's what they have been thinking for some time. And we have the Two of Cups. But then with the Seven of Pentacles, Two of Cups, they want to be with you. But there's distance here, or if it's not distance, then somebody is more convenient or closer to this person, or one of you guys gives in a little bit more, and that's why they were thinking about that, or it's just they wanted both relationships, six of wands, four of pentacles. So yeah, they were going to ride this relationship or situation out, and if it just fell apart or ended, then they were just going to fully focus on you. But I see where you lost interest, though, or like I said, you confronted them about something. They're lying and you know the truth. I'm going to tell you guys, the truth is going to be either in their texts or their DMs. And for some of you guys, it's somewhere where you're not thinking to check. So say if this person scrolls on Instagram a lot then the messages are going to be like in their Facebook because they feel like you wouldn't think to look through there. Or if they're on Facebook a lot, it's going to be Instagram or somebody sending Snap or whatever. It's going to be like a, a platform or something that you never really see them on or that you wouldn't think that they would be on. Okay? All I'm, I just keep hearing the truth is right in front of you. Yep, see, eight of cups reverse. I told you that was their plan. So if this didn't, they were going to ride this out. If this didn't work, work out, they were going to come back to you full time and fully invest in this relationship. That's what I'm getting here. 
Pisces. That's what they were going to do. Mm -hmm. You're the person that they really want to move forward with anyway. You're the person that they really do want to be with the Wheel of Fortune. But I don't know. It was something about this other person or this other relationship or situation that they had going on. But they're going to get played. There's some lesson there. Some lesson to be learned. They're going to get played, I feel like, for the 10th time by this person. Or this person is really good at playing games, manipulating them. So let's see. Pisces. We have, uh, let's see. Text buddy, texting and sending pictures, but that's about it. So they're texting somebody, or you guys can be texting and sending pictures. We have healing. Someone is healing our needs to focus on healing. So maybe they're still needed to heal from this other relationship. And that's why, you know, they got these feelings or caught up or getting played by this person. Because they maybe they're still open to that person. We have scared. I like this person is scared to open up and tell you something. Sexual connection. So you guys have a really good sex connect, like sexual connection. Like the sex is good between you guys all in. Let's work things out through the good, bad, and ugly. It's easy to leave, but I want to stay. See, that's what I'm saying. So they're going to be all in and wanting to work things out after they get played or after they realize something. Let's see what else we got. Just for fun and friends with benefits. They might tell you that this person was just friends with benefits or that's what they're telling the other person about you. But it says good times, good company, getting out the house and having fun. So I feel like they may tell you that they were doing something just for fun, but I feel like it was more than that. I honestly feel like it was more than just for fun. I feel like because it was easy, it was convenient, this person was available, or somebody is, that's what I'm getting with somebody, somebody's easy, convenient, available, you know, um, and we have one-sided, this connection is not balanced, something needs to be addressed, they can have an intense connection with somebody, and somebody could be obsessed, or they can be obsessed with somebody, or maybe just obsessed with the toxicity, or the intense connection between somebody, but I feel like it was toxic, or they had something going on there, um, let's see, Pisces. This came out in Gemini's reading. I'm setting my ways, and it says you have greatly um sorry you have greatly impacted my life. So maybe you made a huge impact on this person's life. That's what I'm saying. Remember I told you when I saw the Ten of Cups, I'm like, somebody's like, oh, so you want to be like that now? You want to go talk to somebody like that or something like that? Um, but let's see. I'm set in my ways. We have the Three of Wands. Yeah, so whoever this person is, they've always had a side person. They've always had another person. This person travels a lot or works on the road or always is traveling, always in and out of town or something like that. And where it says I'm set in my ways, this person is like a player or always have had somebody or this person is the type of person like they they always they always have somebody to go to you know they always got someone so like if things don't work out between you they're gonna deal with somebody else or mess around with somebody else like that's what they're sitting their ways at you know but being claiming that they want to be with you and all that type of stuff king of pentacles this can be somebody that gets money too you know um but it can also tell me that this is somebody that you know they will commit to you but they what they do and their what their their ways about them is that they always got they always are gonna have somebody else. You know? It's always gonna be somebody on the side or they're gonna be messing with somebody or something. They're always gonna have a situation on the side. But with the you have greatly impacted my life, maybe this person may change. I don't know, people do change, but the way this reading is popping up, I'm not sure. I can't say that just yet about this person. But um yes pisces so they will get played in a situation play used and abused by somebody for like the hundredth time sorry i know that was so unprofessional i didn't mean to yawn in y'all reading sorry but um maybe y'all just tired of their shit maybe that's how y'all feel y'all probably like ugh this mother but yes pisces that's what i got for y'all I hope it resonated to you guys a lot. Full love, light, healing, energy, and abundance. XOXO. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next reading. If it resonated, give your girl a thumbs up. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. And if you guys want the book, fireintuition.com. Bye, Pisces.